Hey folks, how y'all doing? Today, today we're gonna be um, installing a new um, smart TV. It's a Samsung H4500 28 inch class HD smart LED TV. My little insignia, Best Buy deal, 22 inch, got a line going across the screen. It started going, no good. Uh, it just, I, I just, it just is gone. I mean, 2015, and just took a, you know what? And I got inside my office here. Everything is nice and snug, temperature controlled. But that's the TV we're replacing today. As an insignia, and I got a. It's a 24 inch, but I'll be replacing with the. This is the box that came in. This is a B and H. Got it from B and H Photo. The Samsung H4500 series, and I'll give you the model number underneath of it. It's uh, here's the model number right here. Manufacturer number UN28H4500 AFXZA. So yeah, yeah, pretty nice little system. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and take it out of the box, the big box, and I'll show you it looks like on the outside. All right, bear with me. Okay, y'all, we don't have much room to work with in here. This is only an eight by 12 building. I mean, room. Here it goes, coming out of the big box right here. Plenty of packing tape, uh, packing bubbles. There we go. Woo like I say, it's a LED TV, 28 inch smart HD TV. And I'll zoom in on the, uh, the model number. But uh, I'm going to, hope it don't fall over. That would stink, really stink. Sorry about that. But here are the model numbers on it. It has two HDMI ports, I think two USD, USB ports, because I'll be running my my um, antenna and everything from here. There we go. Forty-five hundred series, twenty-eight inch class. In the motion range, I think it's sixty hertz. But can go up to 120. And uh, pixelation, the pixels, it's 720 by 1388. So, hey, not, um, it, it'll do what I want to do for right here. It's a small area. And I have external speakers up here my Bose computer speakers. Up there, one up there. And another one up here. To give it the ultimate sound. All right, let's go back to the TV. But anyway, that's my old trusty gun safe. All right, let's get back to business. But yeah, I gotta. I'm gonna take the other one off the wall first before we start getting um too carried away. So all right, y'all hang tight. Okay, y'all, we got the. Uh, TV on mounted from the uh, wall mount, and there's all my RCA cables, my HDMI's, my Ethernet or Ethernet, Ethernet sounds better, and everything's disconnected. And I run another Ethernet cord down from the top. I know it sounds crazy, but I got my DVD player, Sony DVD player hooked to my. It's a smart Blu-ray player. Well, I'm also going to have another Ethernet cable running from the red one. Uh, that's going to be running from my, to my, t the TV, the smart TV. Uh, and here is the TV itself. Right there. I just got to disconnect that, uh, the bracket on the back. We should be set. All right. So, all right, here we go, back to work. 
and this new TV over here has five watts of power each for each speaker, so ten watts all together. The old one's got the old one has three watts per each speaker, so it's only six watts. This one, so this one should be a lot louder and better sound quality. All right. Okay, y'all, we're gonna um, go ahead and box this bad boy. Got my trusty Leatherman out. Use Leatherman wave on all my stuff. Great stuff. And the TV says up right front right here. And I use my serrated edge also. Got my CNI glasses on. All right. Woo. Okay. Put my screwdriver here. Get that out of the way. Okay. We got brackets for this puppy. We're not gonna be using brackets. We're, we've got to we're using a wall mount. Yep. I believe that's what it is. Yep. Wall mount bracket. Leave that in there. Okay, we got oh. that didn't just happen, but it did. Good thing we had the couch so I had to sit on. All right, TV's out of there. Remote control, accessory kit, plug, the whole nine yards. Batteries. Got the old trusted manual. All right, put that over here. I think this is the back. This is like a. Uh, it's for the back stand, I believe. We'll see. All right. Nothing much left in here except the cardboard. Put that over there for right now. Yes, yeah, for the about back uh, mounting bracket for the back. So, all right. Yes, yeah, for a back mounting bracket. Okay, show you what the back looks like. The back looks pretty cool, y'all. Got your RCA puts. Okay, that's nice. Got your RCA ports right here, and your two HDMI's, and Ethernet right here, and let's see your USB ports right there, and the antenna for the antenna TV goes right here. All right, and the these four holes on the mounting bracket. So we'll go ahead and do that now. Put the mounting bracket on there. That way we'll see what we got to work with. Alright. Hey folks, we're back installing the uh, Samsung uh, 4500 series. And we are, we got to change out this bracket. It's a Santa's bracket. Um, but it's not the right model. It will not work. Plus, you know, just didn't have long enough screws and all that stuff. So, we'll change that out, and we'll be back in business. All right, be back here shortly. And that's all full motion tilt. It tilts down this way. It comes out, or it fold back in. All that good stuff. This, this new one's the same way. So let's get rolling on that. All right. Okay, folks, we got our bracket mounted on our TV. 
that was a that was a, I had to do some modifications. I had to cut the spacers, the hacksaw, and all that good stuff. And I also had to cut a ear off where the Ethernet port is. Ethernet, whichever way you want to call it. Right there, I had to cut that one ear. Right there, if you see that. If you look at the other one, you barely can't really see it. Yeah, there you go. See how that one's got like a little ear on it? Well, this one over here doesn't. I cut that with a wafer wheel, a cutting disc. So you have room to, for your ether, uh, Ethernet port. So just be careful when you buy a, a bracket, make sure it fits. And if you want to make it a smart TV, that's your best way to make a smart TV, hook it, hook it up direct. All right, let's mount this puppy up on the wall. Woo. All right, there's my bracket. A Santa's full swing bracket. All right, there we go. Got our bolt right here. That goes on top. Right here, after we get in place. I'll pick this up by the protection, well, by the case, that is. There we go. She is on there. Now we might have to do some mods to get it leveled up, but we'll fix that. All right, we'll come back. We're gonna level this puck thing up. Just have to loosen the screws in the back and let her go. All right, we'll be back here in a minute. Okay, now we got our TV mounted up on there, and it's looking great, nice and level. Here's a torpedo level, get a nice and plumb. Plumb means level for those of y'all. Yeah, it's looking pretty sweet. I'm not kidding. It's doing a heck of a job. Looking good so far. All right, I'm gonna hook my cables up and all that stuff, and we'll see how she goes. All right. All right, come out of here. Samsung 20H, 28 inch. Uh, I think it's a, it's a 4,500. Uh, it's an H4,500. All right. Let's see what we can do here now. All right. Okay, folks, we got the uh, TV, all the, the antenna cable the uh, RCA jacks from my older DVD player down there. Uh, both HDMI's, one going to the um, Blu-ray, Sony Blu-ray player, and the other one's going to the cable box, right there. And the power is, the power. Here's the power cord right there, folks. And I got a little better picture on that. There she is. All right. Well, we're going to do a couple other things here. We're going to see if we got power and all that good stuff and power up here in a second. All right. All right let's face her the way we want it. We got to put batteries. Still got to put batteries in remote control. All right. And this can, this can come back. That's what I like about this type of mount. There you go. You can you can have it. You can you can if you're sitting up at my desk over here, I can turn the TV that way and look at it. Or I mean, it's just, it's great. Oh, torpedo level. Mm, she's a little off. That's this adjustment back here. And this thing will tilt, folks. This thing will tilt. Um, it's supposed to. 
it's supposed to tilt. Yeah. See, look at that. It'll tilt. And all kind of neat things, so. Yeah, it'll tilt and all kind of fun things. It's a great little mount. Alright, so just be careful when you're doing it when you're tilting it like that. Okay. Let me, put my, let me put my battery remote control. Alright. Okay, y'all. Let's turn her on. See what we got. There we go. That dog. It's got to do its thing. All right. Let's see what we got here. English. Yep. English. Okay. Network set. Checking network. Wired network section. You are connected to the internet. If you have any problems online, switch contact internet service provider. Okay. Next smart hub. Number three, smart hub terms conditions. I agree to all. Oop. All right, next. All right, confirm. Okay. All right. Configure your TVs, cable box, home use, home use, and cable box. Ooh, cable vision. Comcast. I'll oh, see if the Xfinity is on here. They change the name so much. Uh, Comcast. All right. Set up control tests. Oh, okay. okay. I'm gonna set the our our cable up. Okay. Be right back, folks. Pretty cool. Connect the IR extender cable and this allows the Samsung TV remote to change to the channel on uh, setup box cable box and other control device. Connect the cable to the IR out of the back. Place it in front of your device you would like to control. Alright, we can do that. Alright. Okay, y'all, this is an IR device right here. It's all goes in the back of your TV. And it's like a, it's like a little receiver type deal. It goes near your cable box or your satellite box. All right. And it's pretty bad to play. It's a Samsung on it. Um, lighting here is not real good. There we go. Anyway. Pretty good deal. All right, we'll set that up. Okay, folks, the IR extender is cable is connected, as it says right there, and here it is, right up here. Um, that little round thing right there. I showed y'all before. There it is. But we'll see how it works. It's recommending it, so I'm doing it. Follow instructions. All right. Okay, here we go. All right, got that. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Flight. Well, that's that's always going oh, to be goodness. very special. Let right, me turn it. Why is this your last, Jim? Turn down the volume. Okay. Uh, I don't want to get copyright. Okay. Pretty suck TV import. That's HDMI one. I can't imagine okay. uh, ever topping it. Channel that. up. I would like to take a moment to address my fellow veterans because I know there are so many of you who have served your country honorably, whether it's two years, four years, or 32 years like myself. One of the All benefits right. Right. we as a country give you. 
Okay, y'all, it says the uh, um, upload's complete. I'm press OK. And, and it's just searching for apps and all kind of cool stuff. Feature Samsung. Okay, there's a smart, there's a smart hub right there. It's pretty cool. I'll set all that stuff up. Okay, let's go to source. Let's let's look at my antenna and see what we can get on that. We'll go to source. Okay, CMI, Comcast, nope. T TV. Okay. Check the ground connector. Okay. I'm gonna let's go to menu. We got we gotta do a scan. Menu broadcasting. Alright. Auto program. Oh, let's go back. Antenna. Air uh we're gonna air. Okay. Auto program. Start. Okay, there we go. There you go, y'all. We we are searching for channels, and it's a cloudy, rainy day outside today. It is like, ugh, it's a heck of a day out there. But it's a sweet TV. Ninety-eight, ninety-nine percent. Forty-four channels Take are memorized. Your supplement insurance plans All right. may help cover some of what Medicare doesn't Close. Pay. All right, that's regular TV, y'all. With a Medicare supplement plan, um, you'll be able to stay with you the doctor. Press menu. Oh, you know, I love that guy. Mm -hmm. These types of plans let you visit any doctor. And go get a session. channel. Here. I mean, no. Not a bash. That's pretty cool. Radar. Yeah, it's a, it's a it's a great picture, y'all. Huh? Seventy one degrees outside in Richmond. The YWCA of Richmond also offers a twenty four hour hotline for anyone. But anyway, hey, y'all, that's some cool stuff. Through that hotline, um, we'll, we'll, I'm gonna figure some more stuff out in here. I don't want to get too much copyright. Just a person to talk to, talk through a crisis situation. Channel. like yours come to it's a lot We're yeah all right we'll, we'll get off of here yeah. I got all kind of cool channels your rate all right let's get on off of here group of graduate students working with Robert okay folks I am back I got my YouTube up on my smart hub and I typed my name, bam, on my channel, KVUS, KVUSMC. And I'll, it'll pop up um, a video, see here, uploads. I mean, it's just, it's just a crystal clear picture. I mean, it's just pretty cool. <laughs> Great sound. I don't think I can get a copyright on my own video. Okay, good. But What's a good substitute for butter? Got to watch. Cup of butter. Well, substitute three quarters cup of olive oil. Let's see. Okay, Google. What's a good substitute for olive oil? All right, here we go. Pretty nice picture, y'all. I mean, it's just awesome. And I shoot all my um videos and. In HD. So yeah. Hey folks. Hey. I'll turn the volume up a little bit. Doing a video on the put up a new Lucky's two man gun blind, blind up today. Here's the old blind. This old Ameris out. So it's your eighty nine dollar deal. And... Okay, folks. Here's a uh, what's doing. People. Doing pretty good. I mean, this material is just like look. Look at it. Just. So, limb come through, bam. That's you too. It, it just tore it all to heck. And let's go but to something else. Y'all can see how it ripped it all up. 
And but like I say, you get what you pay for. Got a great picture. Not, not bad for an $89 job or $79, sometimes 100 some places. Yeah, you get what you pay for. So, yeah, I mean, it's, these blinds, it's an awesome TV. They don't have the, the strength like the other ones do. But, uh, you know, we're going to take this apart and take it down. Okay. It's my little squirrel, my little squirrel hunting paradise here. All through here. And then, uh, damn, that's a new luck is good. All right, let's pause this. Then we'll exit it. All right, exit. Okay, return, exit. And this is the uh, cable TV part coming up now. We'll show that, show, we'll show that for too long. <laughs> You down too long get copyright. So I can always cut that out a little bit. That happened in my last video, but it is a Samsung. Well, that's Amazon Prime. Pretty cool. Good stuff. Good stuff. Um anyway, we're gonna cut this short, y'all. Let's see, man, I just not hadn't been a short video. Okay, exit. Then we'll go to. It's the Egyptian sun god. Then we'll just cut the TV off. They think he sent us. All right. But yeah, all together, it's got good volume. And here's the remote control, folks. It's a big, important deal here. Um, it's more light on the subject. And here we go. But here's the remote control. You got your smart hub right here. Um, on off your picture. I mean, it's just a little bit of everything. I mean, it's got everything you need, and then some. I'm bringing it a little closer. Um, we got all your controls. It's it's a nice remote control. It's beefy. Don't lose it. It comes with two tri comes with two triple A's also. All right. Well, um, this is the my review on the. I'll show you here. I haven't taken this stuff off yet, but I'm gonna leave it there. Hey, like mini pearl. Let's see how good it is for a while. But anyway, uh, here's a TV. The Samsung. 4500 right here here's numbers of it it's a H4500 series LED tw on TV HD it's a great keep great TV but uh yeah y'all I want to thank y'all for watching subscribe um and um um please subscribe and give me a thumbs up, thumbs down, and hey, God bless and Semper Fi. I hope you like the review and the install. It's a um, nice TV, nice TV. Highly, highly recommend it. I got it for $155. I think it'd be an H photo. And they got a 30 day return policy. And something ain't right or whatever, they're gonna, they're gonna look out for you. Now, B&H, all right. Like B&H photo, the good stuff. Cameras, gear. Anything you want, they, they got it. They got it. So anyway, y'all, hey, again, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. God bless and Semper Fi. Hoorah. Y'all have a good one now. All right. Bye-bye.